here at the Bengaluru Tech Summit. This is the largest tech summit in Asia. Hundreds of innovators, entrepreneurs, student entrepreneurs have put up this stall inside. Thousands of people have visiting the summit as you can see and this year theme is breaking boundaries. Let's go inside to see what's there in store for us and is it really breaking boundaries? Let's go. Mr. Mahender, who is the founder of Atikapi for a while now, and uh, he was asking me that um, there is one of their uh, mission is to empower people of all capabilities. Right? Uh, there is a there is a common phrase we use for people with disability, uh, which is called specially able people, and that is a way in which we also distinguish them. And um, we envision that. The phrase specially able should be gone because that should not be a criteria that should be used to hire them and pay them salaries. So the question that I received was what can we do with the support of artificial intelligence and robotics to create equal job opportunities so that these special children are not special anymore. They are just one amongst all of us. They can live a life. They can take care of their family all by themselves. Financially independent, yes. And in fact, uh, some of the uh, some of the people that we see here, right? So, Miss uh, Miss Chumbita here, and uh, Mr. Nandakumar, and also Mr. Nagraj. Uh, all these people, so they have some kind of disability. So, Chumbita is visually impaired. Nagraj is visually impaired. Nandakumar is mobility impaired. Now, if we can create a robotics technology, so robot actually brings in different modalities. Robot brings in something called perception, something called mobility, motion and also interface, human-robot interface through touch and visual feedback. All these are uh, modalities that can be used as substitutions for, to address a certain kind of impairment in a person. So in that, in that sense, we felt that a combination of robotics technology along with artificial intelligence for autonomous behaviors can actually enable uh, differently able people to be independently functional and run an entire cafe all by themselves. So can you tell us how is this product helping them? How, how does it work? How does the product help to uh, get disabled people jobs? Yes. So uh, I'll show you quickly uh, a braille keyboard. So in this, demo, in this demonstration here, what we have is uh, a visually impaired person who is actually uh, operating the, the, the cafe cashier cash counter. So as you can see here, uh, this is a keyboard which has braille stickers on top of it and uh, mostly uh, most educated uh, uh, visually impaired people they, they go through uh, this training called braille training so they, they are taught how to read and write through braille now what we thought is when a customer comes to a cafe uh, he can basically he she or anybody can basically order a cafe or a coffee by having an interaction with our visually impaired person now they are trained to use the keyboard and translate the order that they receive that is received into a command that it can be sent to the robot so this braille keyboard that you see here so for example if we have a coding which says filter coffee is one yeah so i can give a live demo of this so we can ask uh, our chumbita here to specifically uh, create an order request for um, for a special a special kind of coffee Yarudu type the sir filter coffee matha machine coffee the filter coffee li moor tara varute sir Mysore coffee Mysore maggots Mansur Malabar anda machine coffee bande India na express matte coffee cafe chana anta the sir so ni yau tavala kista parti the sir madam nange Mansur Malabar coffee beko okay ni yau table ali kuch kuch tera anda help the sir nanu table B hatra hokti ni madam Okay, sir, please have your seat, sir. Definitely okay, we'll serve the best Indian coffee. Thank you, ma'am. Thank, Thank you, sir. Thank okay. you so much. Nandakumar Arundhuma. 
மன்சூர் மல்லபார் காஃபி ஸோ ஸோ தட் இஸ் ஹவு தி ஆர்டர் இஸ் ப்ராசஸ்ட் Okay, and then this machine automatically serves the coffee to the table and then the customer can pick up their coffee. So now what you saw through the braille input, the robot was commanded a, a command to actually deliver a coffee uh, of the specific type. So the, the coffee type was mentioned and also the location where I am seated was mentioned. So then, the, then it went to Mr. Nandakumar. She also verbally communicated the order to Nandakumar. we also are working on uh, enhancing this by actually showcasing the order visually so and like i said earlier mr nandakumar there he is a mobility impaired person so what we are doing now is the order that was prepared by mr nandakumar since he has mobility impairment we don't have to let him walk but the robot will do the job for him so he prepared the coffee he puts it on the coffee tray and then the coffee is taken to the customer so this is the way we integrate robotics technology along with artificial intelligence because there has to be some decisions made so generally a lot of people confuse artificial intelligence with machine learning there is there are two different things it is artificial intelligence is a bigger concept it is a way in which we can enable machines to follow certain commands that we humans ask them to give and we can also train machines to learn certain behaviors and that part is machine learning so autom- autonomous so artificial intelligence is a broader scheme of things so this is the way we have leveraged artificial intelligence and robotics to enable specially able children here and one more point i would like to mention is special ability is commonly misunderstood uh, to be something that is visually visible to normal as normal human beings so for example it could be a visual impairment or a mobility impairment or a hearing impairment but disability or uh, special abilities or limitations i would say in some certain sense are sometimes not visible for example autism it's a very understudied subject uh, at least it is getting more and more visibility and understanding nowadays but uh, it is generally ignored and um, so even like the, when when we have to work with these kind of people uh, it is important to understand that they have their own world and we have to respect that we can't enforce them to live in our world but that doesn't mean that they are just because they can they live in a different perception of the world they should be isolated so in our uh, hatti coffee stalls we also have some of our employees who prepare coffee they are also uh, having autism in fact some of the things that we have observed is some of the uh, customers have told us that um, the taste of the coffee is so perfect and some of those children who have prepared that coffee are actually autistic children so this is also one way to see that you know a disability is not a disability anymore it is also uh, it, it, there is equal opportunity for all kinds of disability and another uh, uh, angle we are also looking at is uh, seniors uh, were in uh, you know a post retirement so in hatikapi there is something called as a second innings club and uh, in fact we actually don't call elderly people or retired people as senior citizens we actually call them as recycled teenagers this concept was given to us by uh, one of the designers at chitrakala parishad and uh, so that is actually a very inspiring concept so we also have some senior citizens as a part of our workforce and we notice that um, there is an extremely thorough enjoyment that is visible amongst uh, senior citizens when they are a part of this workforce so in, in all in all to summarize uh, we are trying to leverage robotics and ai technology to create equal job opportunities for everyone so wealth should not be limited only for the normal the normal in quotes people wealth should be uniformly distributed across all people irrespective of what their abilities are this is our vision and we are doing our best to achieve that thank you uh, also so just to clarify this is basically like uh, you have your own stalls where you use this ai uh, based machine as well as the people from your staff will serve the coffee but it's not a cafe cafe right in bangalore or is there a cafe specifically no that is not yet so this is the very first time this whole uh, idea is being demonstrated and it is actually shown to the public um we have ideas to actually uh, scale this and make a real cafe out of this um this is a demonstrator where we wanted to introduce the concept to our audience and once this introduction is done we are looking at uh, scaling it and scoping it bahala santosha aitamma ee ondu ಇವರ ಒಂದು ಕನಸಿದೆಯಲ್ಲ 
ವಿಭಿನ್ನವಾಗಿ ಅವರು ಇದ್ದವರು ಅವರು ವಿಕಲಾಂಗರಾಗಿರೋರಿಗೆ ಅವ್ರಿಗೆ ಅವರೇ ಒಂದು ಲೀಡರ್ ಅಂದರೆ ಅವ್ರಿಗೆ ಒಂದು ನಾಯಕತ್ವದ ಒಂದು ಸ್ಥಾನ ಕೊಡಬೇಕು ಅಂತ ಮಾಡ್ತಾರಲ್ಲ ಅದು ಭಾಳ ಮುಖ್ಯ ಯಾಕೆಂದರೆ ಅವ್ರಿಗೆ ಸಹಾಯ ಮಾಡೋದು ಮಾಡ್ತಾರೆ ಎಲ್ಲರೂ ಮಾಡ್ತಾರೆ ಆದರೆ ಮಹೇಂದರ್ ಅವರು ಅವ್ರಿಗೆ ನಾಯಕತ್ವ ವಹಿಸ್ಕೊಡೋಕ್ಕೆ ಯಾಕಾಗಲ್ಲ ಅನ್ನೋದು ಮಾಡ್ತಾರಲ್ಲ ನನ್ನ ಜೀವನದಲ್ಲಿ ಕುಡಿದಿದ್ದ ಒಳ್ಳೆ ಬೆಸ್ಟ್ ಕಾಫಿ ಇವತ್ತೆ ಯಾಕೆಂದರೆ ಒಬ್ಬರು ಹೊಸ ನಾಯಕತ್ವ ಮಾಡಬೇಕು ಅಂತ ಕೂತಿದ್ದಾರೆ ಅದು ಭಾಳ ಭಾಳ ಚೆನ್ನಾಗಿ ಭಾಳ ಸಂತೋಷ ನಾನು ಐ ಕಂಗ್ರ್ಯಾಚುಲೇಟ್ ಹಿಮ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಅವ್ರಿಗೆ ಭಾಳ ಒಳ್ಳೆಯದಾಗಲಿ ಇದರೊಳಗಡೆ ಅವರು ಒಂದು ರಾಷ್ಟ್ರ ಮಟ್ಟದಲ್ಲಿ ಒಂದು ಗುರ್ತು ಮಾಡೋ ಮಾ ಮಾಡಲಿ ಅಂತ ನನ್ನ ಆಶ್ರಯ ಎಲ್ಲರೂ ಗೊತ್ತಿರಬೇಕು ನಮಸ್ಕಾರ ಒಂದನೆಗಳು ಕೇದರ್ ಸರ್ ಇಸ್ ಮೋಸ್ಟ್ ಸೆಲೆಬ್ರೇಟೆಡ್ ಐ ಎ ಎಸ್ ಆಫೀಸರ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಸ್ಟೇಟ್ ಈ ಈಸ್ ಎ ರಿನೌಂಡ್ ಆಫೀಸರ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಕಂಟ್ರಿ ಎಸ್ ಸರ್ವ್ಡ್ ವಿತ್ ರಿಲೆಂಟ್ಲೆಸ್ಲಿ ಸ್ಟಿಲ್ ಈಸ್ ವರ್ಕಿಂಗ್ ಸ್ಟಿಲ್ ಈಸ್ ಸರ್ವಿಂಗ್ ಸೊ ಥ್ಯಾಂಕ್ಸ್ ಟು ಯು ಸರ್ ಥ್ಯಾಂಕ್ಸ್ ಟು ಆಲ್ ಸಿ ಮೈ ಐ ಮೈ ವಿಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಟೆಕ್ ಇಸ್ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ದ ಟೈಮ್ ಆಫ್ ಬೋತ್ ಸರ್ವಿಸ್ ಟೇಕರ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಸರ್ವಿಸ್ ಪ್ರೊವೈಡರ್ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಡೋಂಟ್ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ದ ಟೈಮ್ ದೆನ್ ಟೆಕ್ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ನೀಡೆಡ್ ಬಟ್ ಇಫ್ ಯು ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ದ ಟೈಮ್ ಆಫ್ ಎ ಸರ್ವಿಸ್ ಗಿವರ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಎ ಸರ್ವಿಸ್ ಟೇಕರ್ ಬೋತ್ ದೆನ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ ಫಾರ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಸಂಬಡಿ ಕಮ್ಸ್ ಟು ಯು ಗೌರ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಆಫೀಸ್ ಹಿ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಟು ಇನ್ವೆಸ್ಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಟೈಮ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ರಿಸೋರ್ಸ್ ವೈ ಡಿ ಯು ವಾಂಟ್ ಹಿಮ್ ಇಫ್ ಐ ಗೋ ಟು ಯು ಹಾಸ್ಪಿಟಲ್ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಇನ್ವೆಸ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ಮೈ ಟೈಮ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ರಿಸೋರ್ಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ಗೆಟ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಮೈ ಪೇಮೆಂಟ್ ಟು ಹಾಸ್ಪಿಟಲ್ ನಾವು ಹೌ ಡು ಐ ಎನ್ಶೋರ್ ದಟ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಲೀಸ್ಟ್ ಸ್ಪೆಂಡ್ ಬಟ್ ಒಪ್ಟೈನಿಂಗ್ ಆಪ್ಟಿಮಮ್ ಬೆನಿಫಿಟ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ವಿ ಮಸ್ಟ್ ಲುಕ್ ಅಟ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಸೊಸೈಟಿ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಕಮಿಂಗ್ ಡೇಸ್ ವಿ ಆರ್ ಹೋಲ್ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ ಈಸ್ ಮೂವಿಂಗ್ ಟುವರ್ಡ್ಸ್ ದಿ ಎಲ್ಡರ್ಲಿ ಫಾರ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ವಾಟ್ ಮಹಿಂದರ್ ಈಸ್ ಡೂಯಿಂಗ್ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ನೆಸೆಸರ್ಲಿ ದ ವೇ ಹೀಸ್ ಲುಕಿಂಗ್ ತರ್ಟಿ ಇಯರ್ಸ್ ಡೌನ್ ದ ಲೈನ್ ದ ಹೋಲ್ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಫುಲ್ ಆಫ್ ಎಲ್ಡರ್ಲಿ ನಾವು the only way there there are lot of elders who want to drink coffee but there is nobody to come and give see this is another vision for him understand now countries are becoming a very elderly yeah, yeah. gdiatric or gerontocracy is going to creep in then how does he sell coffee there are no youngsters to go and take and give it to them what a wonderful vision for him in future maybe we may be little late but he must start thinking scandinavian countries europe northern europe they are all already Absolutely. wonderful uh, so as you could see here at the tech summit there is no uh, limit to the amount of uh, you know innovation that can be done and at hartley cafe as uh, at hartley cafe as we could see uh, they have created a really uh, beautiful they have used the technology in the most beautiful way and have enabled the disabled people uh, to be more efficient to become wealthy as well as to have a more dignified life by getting the financial independence and as they say that the senior citizens are not senior citizens or elderly but it's the recycled teenagers and they are creating more jobs for them as well and as uh, giving them a good opportunity to enjoy after the so called retirement this is akshita mehta reporting for daily salar digital